Hey everybody, Sharon here from TheGimmyAct.com. Here we are today in Looking for Aliens, going for all of the main storyline achievements. So what you want to do is you want to make sure you start up a new game by picking level 1, and that should load you into the game. You're going to get a cutscene at the start of every level. You can skip these by hitting the Y button if you don't want to pay attention to the story. Now, we are going to take advantage of the Chili Dog cheat code in order to get through the game super fast. So at any time during the game, you could do up, up, down, down, up, up, right, left, left, right on the D-pad, followed by the X button. That should bring up the cheat menu. Make sure you enable the one and only cheat, which is next level LS slash L3. That should basically allow you to skip a level by just clicking in the left stick. And then every time you skip a level, you should also be given every single task in the level as well. So you should be given two achievements for completing each level. And then you can actually do this for every single level. So once you get that respective level's achievements, what you want to do is want to make sure you hit the back button, which should advance to the next level. You should be given your cutscene. Make sure you skip it with the Y button. And then make sure you click in left stick to get your tasks in as well as complete the level. And then you should be good for another two achievements for every single level. Then hit the back button to advance to the next level. Y button to skip the opening cutscene. And then click in left stick. And then you're just going to repeat this for every single level of the game. There's going to be a total of 25 levels in the game. The cheat is going to work for every single one of them. And then doing this from start to finish is going to get you every single achievement for beating all of the levels, completing all of the tasks in all of the levels, as well as picking up all of the collectibles in every single one of the levels. So you should be good for a plethora of achievements along the way. Of course, as always, I am going to recommend whenever trying to unlock achievements on Moss, you are going to want to let them fully pop all the way so you don't run into any scripting problems with achievements not unlocking. But of course, if you do ever miss anything for this reason, you can always go back as the game does feature a level select. So after you have beaten the game, you can go back and replay any level you want and then clean up any achievements you may have missed. So utilizing this method should allow you to get from beginning of the game to the end in about 8 to 10 minutes or so. So just make sure you keep up on the pattern of hitting the Y button at the start of every level to skip your cutscene, clicking in the left stick to pop your two achievements, and then finally hitting the back button to advance to the next level. And you're going to do this until you get to the game's credits at the end of level 25. And that should take care of all but a handful of other cumulative achievements that are going to be very easy, especially once you have the ability to use the level select.
So once you finally skip your last level, which is going to be level 25 using the cheat, you should be good for every single achievement relating to beating levels. You should be good for all of the achievements dealing with completing tasks in each of the levels. And you should also be good for the achievements for getting all of the collectibles in all of the levels. So once the credits start rolling and you head back to the main menu, you should be done with the bulk of the game. We still have that handful of achievements relating to cumulative stuff, which we will cover. But that's going to wrap it up for now. Hope you enjoyed the guide. And that's all there is to it.